Georgia's Supreme Court today overturned a hot car murder conviction against a Cobb County father. Justin Harris will get a new trial after he was convicted and sentenced to life for leaving his toddler son in a hot car to die. It made news around the nation. The Georgia father who closed the door of his SUV the morning of a hot June day in Atlanta in 2014 and walked into work. Justin Ross Harris was supposed to have dropped off his 22-month-old son Cooper at a daycare center. Instead, the little boy was left strapped into the rear-facing car seat in the back seat of the SUV. After seven hours in the hot car, Cooper died of hyperthermia. In 2016, Harris's trial was moved from Cobb County to Brunswick due to excessive publicity. Prosecutors painted Harris as an unhappy employee and husband who was unfaithful and wanted a child-free life. The defense argued it was all a mistake that he forgot the child was there. Harris was convicted and sentenced to life without parole for deliberately leaving his child to die. His lawyers appealed and the court ruled he did not get a fair trial because much of the evidence of his extramarital affairs, which the state portrayed as the motivation behind his intent to kill his son, unfairly prejudiced the jury. Now that the state's high court has overturned the Cobb County father's conviction, this means Harris is entitled to a new trial. Cobb County prosecutors said in a statement today they plan to file a motion for the case to be reconsidered. Harris did not challenge his convictions for sex crimes against a minor. The state Supreme Court said those convictions stand.